Hey guys, so today I'm here with a quick tutorial showing you how to back up your SHSH blobs on your device. Uh, so of course SHSH blobs are really key if you jailbreak as they allow you to go ahead and downgrade to previous firmware, which is definitely a very, very useful thing. Well, of course there are have been ways to do this before. Uh, you can go ahead and use Tiny Umbrella, I've done several tutorials on that. As well as Cydia does go ahead and automatically do it. However, it kind of takes a little while sometimes, and so it's always nice to have a little backup. Uh, so that's what I'm going to go ahead and show you today, which is called ISHSH it. You'll need to open up Cydia and search I-S-H-S-H it, all one word. Uh, you should go ahead and find it. It is available for free in the Big Boss repo. So once you found it, go ahead and just click install and let it do its thing. So once you went ahead and downloaded and installed I-S-H-S-H it, it is very, very simple. Um, so once you open up the app, this is what you'll see. Uh, it's going to be very simple. It'll tell you about your unique chip ID, what device you have, and what firmware. All that is totally fine. All you need to do is come up here to, and hit this blue button that says save. Uh, now this will take just a moment. It will download and save your SHSH blobs. So there you go. As you can see here, it just says SHSH backup completed successfully. So I can click OK. And then we can go ahead and also go into manage. And if we like, we can go ahead and actually send these to ourselves. So by clicking send all, it will go ahead and actually open up your email. So you can go ahead and email this to yourself and have a local copy of your SHSH blob for your computer so you can do whatever you want. Um, so anyway guys, that's it for my review and the quick little overview of ISHSH it. Very handy little app. If I know a lot of you guys have questions about SHSH blobs, you don't want to have to deal with Tiny Umbrella. Well, this is an even simpler method to be sure that you do have it saved both in Cydia as well as on your computer. Anyway guys, thanks for watching.